Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Grand Centre Point Ratchadamri Hotel, located just off Bangkok's Limpini Park. The hotel forms as a very modestly priced five-star option in a central area in the city. In terms of the overall design, incredibly grand right the way through check-in, up to the lifts and into the room itself. The rooms boast an awful lot of space. I particularly like the authentic wooden flooring and Thai tapestries up above the bed. It's set for a really nice feel in the room itself. As for the view, this was without doubt the standout feature with the Anantara and St. Regis Hotels located just down next to the hotel. It's worth saying that my room was up on the 29th floor, which was exactly halfway up the tower. Alongside this, my room came with a small kitchenette. This wasn't something that I used on this particular visit, but would potentially be useful for some guests. As for the bathroom, this was also fairly spacious. That said, the bathroom was perhaps showing its age a little bit with quite dated fixtures, but it was nice to have the separate bath from the shower unit. I was a regular user of room service at the hotel as I was working throughout most of my stay there. This, for example, was the satay. Alrighty, so let's talk facilities at the hotel. So on this particular floor, it featured a range of different meeting rooms, games rooms, the gym, and the main pool area. As you can see, in terms of the overall look, feel, and design, things were very luxurious and looked absolutely great. The gym overall looked decent. Once again, on this particular trip, I was again dodging any form of exercise, so I didn't sadly get the chance to use it, but overall it did look pretty decent. As for the pool itself, this was a real standout feature of the hotel. They also had a food and beverage menu as part of the pool area. It is worth pointing out though that no alcoholic beverages were served at the hotel. I particularly like the range of seating areas around the pool itself. The staff did a great job of keeping these open despite it being very wet in the middle of Bangkok's wet season. On the ground floor is where you will find the hotel restaurant. This was a Thai and overall it was pretty good having eaten there a number of times. For more hotel options in Bangkok, check out my video in the bottom left-hand side of the screen just now. This was this particular property's much more modern sister hotel. Total price paid for this day, just 60 US dollars a night. Guys, thank you as ever so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.